Hello, this is Bashar Masad from MKN Group. Today we'll be talking about the new features for GrandStream UCM 6100 that uh, were added on firmware 1.07.10. There were many features added and many bugs fixed, but we're going to focus on six of the, what I think personally is one of like, the nicest features that they have added. The first one will be the accessing the phone settings directly from the PPX. So previously we had to go to each phone if we want to do some like changes to the phone, um, local time, local time zone, uh, changing the MPK. The, well, I, I believe the, the best one is now you're going to be able to change the BLFs directly from the PPX without having to go directly to each phone. We're going to see that in details uh, in a minute. Distinctive ringing on inbound routes. So if you have several companies using the same PPX or you have several departments and each one has a different um, uh, SIP trunk or different inbound route, then now uh, you can have a specific or distinctive ring for each of that route. So you know by, you know, when you listen to the phone ringing, you know which one, which uh, number was called. Um, office time, generic office time and holiday settings are supported now too. Um, nice feature about monitoring the FXO trunk, like you know, so if you have uh, landlines connected to the PPX, many resellers, uh, you know, asked about this feature because many people are used to uh, the analog uh, PPX system where they can see the actual line. So uh, I mean the status of the actual line and pick up the call on that line. So this feature will... Um, make that possible now uh, the sla is uh, approximately or uh, you know approximately similar to vlf for internal extension busy lamp field so this is a good feature now music on hold per extension so that's also very nice so we can have a different music on hold for sales different music on hold for support um, follow me support which is different than call forwarding because follow me you can have like different options so um, <clears throat> you can say okay if I'm not available on this extension follow me to that extension then try it for 15 seconds then go to my cell phone if I'm not there try my home number okay so now we're ready to go and start looking at these features on the PPX okay so uh, now let's go to the PPX and go to zero config. Here you see all the phones that are connected. What you can do now, which is really, really, I believe, great. You can go to edit. And now you see the extension. Now you see all the accounts. You can assign the accounts here. You can assign the line keys, the MPKs, um, if you have an extension board. And if you hit advance and go here to modify customized settings, you can even look at uh, if you go all the way down to the bottom, like the contact list, localization, like time, time zone, all that stuff. You can even do the maintenance, like reboot the phone, um, you know, do the upgrade, all these things that initially, like you know, previously, I mean, you you had to go to the phone. Uh, also, you can change the network settings for the phone. Um, and also you can do even the customization. Now you can, for new phones, for example, not this phone, you can download your own logo to the screen of the phone. Very nice feature. Uh, it's gonna make um, the life of installers and users much easier. Next feature is like, you know, the distinctive ranking per inbound route. So here we are in the inbound routes. If I go and hit edit, and you can see here, this is a new item that was added, which is the alert info. That means if the call is coming through this um, inbound route, you can choose what kind of ringtone you want. So choose a number two you can choose whatever you have whatever you want and apply it there okay so the third one is office time and holiday settings uh, setting support so if we go to the uh, PPX 
and we go to uh, internal actually ppx uh, internal options and we go to you should go to oh i'm sorry you go to settings here and you go to time settings not through the ppx through settings time settings and then here you have office time so you create a new office time from what time to what time which day of the week the, your office time is and hit save you can show you can uh, like you know have more advanced options like choose it per day exactly not like you know day of the week but the actual date and the actual month um, okay so this is for the office time now holiday you can add all your holidays and you know choose what you want to do uh, like you know run um, our offices close all that stuff so now you can choose the exact date for um, your office holidays okay so now to monitor the FXO trend using the new SLA feature here's what we need to do step by step the first thing we need to go and uh, create, of course, an analog trunk. I have created one, although it's not connected, but just for the purpose of this video. So we have trunk, we named it FX01. And make sure when you edit the trunk to have the SLA mode checked, if you want to do that, if you want to do like, you know, monitoring. And uh, that's it. That's the first step. The second step will be to go and create a new SLA station. I have created one and assigned it to station 300. So here's what you do. You give it a station name, FX01. I have chosen station three, uh, you know, station 300 for this one. And here you will have a list of available SLA trunks that you have checked the SLA option. And then I have one only, so I have uh, chosen this one. So it's going to go to FX01, um, save. And now the third step will be how do I monitor that from a phone? So thanks to the new feature of being able to change the configuration of the phones directly from the PPX, we go to, let's say, this extension. And you can see here what I've done is for mpk1 oh no i did not do that okay okay so um here the mpks i can say okay mpk1 i want it to be i choose busy lamb field and here like you know it goes to uh, reception 300 okay no i don't think this is correct okay so okay one second please i think have to go here sorry yeah so i have to go to multiple purpose key settings under advanced now I have chosen key one and the mode I give is busy land field which is BLF the account you can choose whatever account you want account one description this is an FX01 the value then you have to be careful here so you start with the extension number which is 300 underscore and the SLA station name so 300 underscore FX01 this first key on this form will reflect the status of um, analog trunk one and you can do more than one or if you have more than one trunk and you can do the same thing on other extensions okay so now uh, let's continue music on hold per extension again thanks to the new feature that we can access the phone directly from the PPX so we go let's say to this phone and when we edit it there will be one feature about music no actually you know what again I'm wrong here I have to go to the PPX and I have to go to the extension itself where where the like, extension was created and hit this edit button and here you can choose different music on hold. Of course, you know, now you can create your own music on hold, 
by going to internal options I believe yes and you go to music on hold and you can create new ones you can like you know we have one on hold music here in our system and under default so we can create a new one and assign it to a different extension and the last but not least feature we're going to talk about is the follow me support so you know we go to the ppx the call features hit follow me i have no follow me here so i create a new follow me and follow me will be per extension so let's say extension my extension next so music on hold uh, default while you know your like the, the follow me is being executed so add the follow me number so let's say if i'm not available dial extension 300 for 15 seconds and add so that's what's going to happen and then add a follow me number again so let's say uh, if i'm not available uh, dial uh, uh, i don't want to do an extension number i want to do an external number and it will say let's say 416-564-7892 and for 20 seconds if nobody answers so now we have two of them and then let's say we can add a third a fourth whatever you want and now we can change the order so here it's going to ring on 300 first i can just pump this up and then it's going to try a cell phone first and then you hit save i'm not going to save it now so i don't want to mess up my extension but that's uh, basically like you know how to do it very good nice feature so um if you have any questions uh, please email us at info at mkngroup.com or visit our website lucidphone.com or you may give us a call at 647-872-2121 we do have um, a very good uh, business uh, plan for uh, like you know void business plan uh, 45 us dollars per month that includes 10 channels 10 concurrent calls and also like you know uh, unlimited calls to all north america this is like you know unbeatable plan um, please um, take advantage of it and if you are a VoIP uh, reseller we do have even better plans for wholesale thank you again this is Bashar Massad from MKN Group